Hi, it's Dylan here for the Windows Guru Show and Windows Guru Live. Um, those of you that have been watching this stream today have noticed that we have some technical difficulties. The camera has fallen down several times. It's about time to get a new uh, mount for the camera. The camera works great. Sound is great. Overall, it's a good camera. Um, just need something better to put it on. Um, for the past few days, I've had the opportunity to try out VMware Workstation 6. Many of you may not know what VMware Workstation 6 is. It is a program that you run in Windows um, or there's a Mac version for uh, Mac OS 10. It's called VMware Fusion. Uh, you can run virtual machines within it, which means if I want to run um, Ubuntu Linux or Red Hat Linux or React OS, which I've done a video on before and I'm doing another one on today. Um, there's many Windows Vista, uh, Windows XP. I could run Mac OS 10, which I'm in the process of downloading. So you can do that. I'm just going to show you guys a little bit of uh, VMware here. This is the main interface. I can make a new virtual machine. I can go through my virtual machines right over here. It'll have them all listed. Like, see, I've got uh, in my favorites, I've got my Windows 95, I've got React OS, Windows XP Professional, and uh, Ubuntu right now. So say I wanted to boot into Windows XP Professional. It's already up, and it's in screensaver right now. So now I can control this separate operating system. I can open Internet Explorer as if it was my on, on the foreground of... Windows, which it is, it's just in this virtual machine. Um, the nice thing about a virtual machine is to be able to multitask, obviously, and run more than one operating system, that's great. Um, but if you were to, if you were testing, okay, I would not want to install React OS on my computer and dual boot it, because it's a very unstable operating system, still in the alpha stages, and if you don't know what it is, that's fine, I'm going to be doing another video on it here in a couple of hours, so just watch the video following this one. Um, so I ran it in uh, VMware, which I can do. I can shut down my Windows XP. We'll go over to React OS, start this virtual machine, and it will boot. It will say which, which, which version I want to uh, start. So we'll start the main version. It will say uh, right here we got the React OS main screen. It's booting and it will boot right into it. And it's in a controlled environment, so I can test it, I can modify it, I can basically do whatever I want to. And if something goes horribly wrong, or it crashes, or would delete data, uh, it won't affect the rest of my computer because it's in that contained environment within VMware. So that's my little um, spiel about VMware Workstation 6. I love it. Uh, it retails for $189 for Windows. And the version for Mac is uh, just a little shy of $100. Uh, plus, if you're installing uh, Windows XP or Windows Vista, you have to pay for the copy of it and install it from CD or an ISO image. Uh, so it can be a very expensive uh, program to run on your computer, but definitely worth it. Uh, I love it just for the fact that I can test new operating systems now. Um, maybe you have another uh, virtual desktop program or virtual machine program that you use, you're welcome to email me anytime with your suggestions, whether it's hardware, software, websites, tech, anything at all really. My email address is windowsgurushow at gmail.com and if you want to suggest them to me live or, or come by the live chat room where we're typically talking about uh, text, whether it's Windows, um, Mac, Linux, uh, hardware, software, websites, and anything tech related really. And we're streaming out this live video and with the chat room and audio 24 hours a day, 7 days a week at windowsguru.weebly.com. See you later.